three-time Grammy nominee Jules Starlight Cafe tour hits town this Saturday. Jewel will be at the Pikes Peak Center performing acoustically in support of her just-released sophomore country album, Sweet and Wild. Springs residents will be among the first to hear her new material live, along with their old favorites. Tickets are still available. You can go to pikespeakcenter.com. The five years after its debut at the Sundance Film Festival in Park City, the Windrider Film Forum is going strong and you can be a part of the cinema in conversation. This year's forum will include the films After the Storm and Dry Land, which will be followed by a Q&A session with the filmmakers and the stars. The fifth annual Windrider Film Forum takes place this Friday and Saturday at Armstrong Theater at Colorado College and July 1st at Stargazers Theater and Event Center. And the NAACP's Juneteenth celebration is this Saturday at Colorado College. The longest standing El Paso County observance of the coming of freedom for all Americans, the Colorado Springs branch NAACP continues the tradition of community coming together with this year's celebration, It Takes a Village. Highlights of this year's event include cultural performances and the NAACP Cafe with some of the best soul food and ethnic cuisine in the West. You can get more information by emailing president at coloradospringsnaacp.org. Pick up The Independent every Thursday for details on all the events that entertain and bring our community together. It's available all around town and online at csindy.com. For the Indy Minute, I'm Jack Ward.